Across the web, over the hill, and under the rug. Pump rail. Pump rail. Today's podcast is sponsored by Pinocchio Art Supply, where you will always be greeted with a pleasant smile, expertise in all your art supply needs, the highest quality and lowest prices around. Pinocchio's helps you make your artwork real. Hi everybody, Todd Lingo here for Puntland. Today is April 28th, 2011. This is podcast number 8. This is uh, the third installment of a four-part series on local artists. Today's artist is Earl Krasanchek. He lives right here in this house. Let's go see what he's got. Welcome, welcome to my humble abode. <laughs> wow, sure looks bigger from the outside. <laughs> Come, follow me to the studio. Come, come, follow me. <laughs> After oh. you. This is your uh, studio? Yes, yes, this is where all the magic happens. When did you get interested in art? The very first time that I can remember I was ever interested in art was back when I was a very small child. we just moved to the States, me and Mom, and it was my first Christmas. And as we were walking up to the, the Santa Claus at the time, because we didn't have this back where I come from, but as I was walking up to the Santa Claus, I just remember this putrid aroma of peppermint schnapps and vomit. Okay, well, what, what inspires you to make something? What doesn't inspire me to make something? <laughs> Everything, every breath I take, this table, this thing, I don't even know what it is, but it inspires me. What else inspires you to uh, create? I play the piano for inspiration. quite prolific. How do you find the time to make all this work? Well, my time is precious, so I do have skilled craftsmen underneath me. Actually, one moment, please. Hey, are you done yet? My arm hurts from coloring too much. Hurry up, or there'll be no porridge. This is where I create. Have you displayed your art in galleries? <laughs> of course. Anywhere there's a refrigerator, all major galleries in the United States, the Lou, I've traveled everywhere and have artwork everywhere, including the moon. <laughs> so how do you market your uh, artwork? One of my favorite means of marketing is actually I take my pieces and I tie them to rocks and then I throw them through my neighbor's windows. It seems to work very well. <laughs> this one isn't even mine. <laughs> Do you have anything else to say about art, philosophy, politics, or life in general? Well, Todd, I just want to say Everything inspires me. Don't let anything deter you from inspiration. All of life is an art form. Thanks for the interview. Good luck with all your uh, future work and uh, the best of luck to you. I'd also like to thank our sponsor, Pinocchio Art Supply, where during the months of April and May, you'll be getting 10% off your purchase if you mention this podcast.
Well, thanks everybody for watching. This is the real Earl Kazanchak here. Next week we'll be having Larry LaFonsi, a uh, puppeteer from Nino, Wisconsin. By the way, this is the real house that we were filming in. If you have any comments, suggestions, or concerns about today's show or any other show, please contact us at puntland.com.